This couldn't wait until I got back into the office on Friday? No. Okay, well, how can I help you? Well, I came by here to let you know some information that I think you would be interested in. What information could you possibly give me? <laughs> well, while you were on vacation, the auditors performed an audit of all the company's accounts. You want to know what they found? What did they find? Over the past five years, our company has lost $500,000. So our firm president hired a special agent to do a background check on all of us. And guess what they found out? What did they find that out? That you're the only person with irregular financial activities opening up bank accounts all across the country and in Switzerland, depositing large sums of money, the company's money. So why did you come over here today to give me this information? Well, I wanted to be the first one to see your facial reaction when I told you the news. Tomorrow at this time, the federal authorities will be here to pick you up and arrest you for embezzlement. Looks like you got greedy, Clarence. You're going to wait for a long time. Mr. Larson, why do you hate me so much? Hate you? I don't hate you. I just don't like you. I've watched you over the years destroy other people's lives. For what? For greed? For power? For money? You're going to wait for a long time, Clarence. I think we're done here. Good day, Mr. Larson. Hello, Maya. How you doing? This is Clarence. I need you to do me a favor. I need you to set up a meeting between me and Tumor. Yeah, I know what you believe. You know, he's the devil. He's trying to steal souls. But I'm not worried about that. I'm worried about the situation that's at hand. This time tomorrow, I'm looking at about 30 to 60 years in the federal penitentiary for some things I've done over a period of five years. And I need to have those things erased completely. So can you set this up for me? I can handle to him. I'm, I'm not afraid of that. Okay, could you set it up for me as soon as possible? I need this resolved tomorrow. No later than tomorrow, 6 o'clock. Okay. Thanks, Maya. Appreciate it. Who the hell 
are you and how did you get in here? You were looking for me, right? Toba? At your service. Well, I have a problem that perhaps you can help me with. And what might that be? Well, let's just say I need the last five years of my history erased without any questions asked. Can you help me with that? Be careful what you wish for, my son. Well, first of all, I'm not your son. Second, can you help me with that problem? Yes, I can. Okay, well, how much is that going to cost me? Your soul. Well, sorry, my soul is not for sale this week. You should have checked with me on that last week. You're only amusing to yourself. So how much is it going to cost me? I prefer your soul, but the money will have to do. Okay, well, I'll give you 20 grand a day and 30 grand tomorrow. Will that work? Yes. Okay. Hmm, I could check this out. Sure. Okay, so let's just get this done, okay? It's been take, taken care of already. Okay. Seven o'clock, no feds, everything's all clear. Toba did his job. He erased my history. Now let me get the hell out of here and go spend all that money. Life is grand. Be careful what you wish for, my son. <laughs>